Hi, I'm Brig, and I'm a fire lookout with the U.S. Forest Service. Let's do a little series on all the different fire lookouts that I've been lucky enough to work in. This one will always be my favorite. It's in the Rocky Mountains. Inside of a 1.5 million acre federally designated wilderness area. It was built in 1932 and all of the equipment was hauled up on horses and mules as it still is today. Nothing motorized in the wilderness area, including helicopters. Until the snow clears on the pass, it's almost a 30 mile hike or a horseback ride in. And then once that pass opens, it's approximately 17 miles. I was up there from June 21st to September 21st. Every three weeks, Bruce, the badass packer that we all know and love, brings food and water, as well as anything else like mail, propane, anything you might need to do some maintenance on the structure. So Bruce is gonna haul up any water you use for cooking, cleaning, bathing, and you just do your laundry in a little wash basin. Take a little sponge bath. There is a little fridge and stove. Those are both run by the big propane tanks that the mules haul up. There's a solar panel that keeps the Forest Service base radio charged. And then it has a very small inverter with a little cigarette lighter adapter that you can plug in your cell phone or iPad. There was decently intermittent cell service in one little spot up there that you could make calls and do texts. I did end up getting a cell booster, which did help a bit. The wildlife was amazing. You guys remember Buddy who would come pretty much every night and sleep in the yard there. And through the season there, I either saw or heard bears, wolves, mountain lion, moose, elk, bighorn sheep, and lots of little critters. There's a little outhouse down the hill. You can see it earlier in this video. And that about covers it. Stay tuned for the next lookout.